Gilbert and George. Are we monogamous? Certainly, Certainly not. not. What do you think we are weird? weird? <laughs> There are eight shows of the urethra pictures this year, so we call it the year of the urethra. And we realized that it would be very good to make a postcard piece based on the sign of the urethra, and because it would make every artwork that we did from that moment make the viewers nervous in some good way. We all know hand, finger, head, ear, but we don't know the urethra. And it's the most important thing. The first of all, it's for the urine, and in the case of the boys, it's for two purposes. It's also to produce the sperm to make more more creatures. You want to be completely confronted in the world, completely clean, like babies that don't know. We have rules. We don't go into other people's houses is one rule. Yeah? We never eat in our house. That's another rule. We never have alcohol in the house unless it's with friends because we want to remain uncontaminated and weird and be normal at the same time. We like raw material. We like it when we leave the house in the morning and we see a pool of vomit on the pavement. All of human life is in, the, in that moment. It's like the biggest novel of all time, just on the pavement. It's like when you're in love, when you are deeply attracted to another person, not only that other person, but everything around you seems different. The garden looks different, the sky looks different. You are transformed to another level. And when you're creating pictures, then you are on an exalted level. You feel completely stimulated and excited. Art for us is seeing the world in a different way. People said, oh, you can't be two people and one artist. Oh, you must make sculpture, you can't do art with colour, you can't do art with sex, you cannot do art with feelings, you cannot have art to do with sentiment. And so those enemies helped to make us, because we're all created by enemies in a way, opposition. Because if they love you too much, you are lost in the end, no? In the end, you don't want it. No? Sometimes we do feel very loved, and we like that very much. Oh, Valentine's Day is very nice. Sometimes, some, some years we get a lot of Valentines. We've got a huge bunch of roses, and we thought, how beautiful, we went to smell them and we realised there was a razor blade inside each rose. We only live for what we do. And that's it, day and night, even in bed, we are living sculptures. Even when we are asleep, we are the dead sculptures, but we are still part of it. So there is nothing else. <laughs>